Hi everyone, welcome back to another episode of Big Boy's Kitchen. Uh, today is part 2 of the Bringo Rice Cure series. And today we're going to be adding a little bit of the Japanese twist to it. So um, we're going we're gonna to call it the, the Bringo Donburi. Alright, so you want to stay tuned to this, alright? Uh, let's, go, let's go right to it. Okay, so the ingredients that we need today are um, one knob of ginger, small knob of ginger, okay, which we will have to ground it up and uh, use the juice for it. So we have cornstarch here, about three tablespoons of cornstarch. Uh, we have four tablespoons of mirin, uh, which is a uh, Japanese sweet wine. Um, we have two tablespoons of soy sauce, um, we have brinjal, we have two medium-sized brinjals. Uh, we also need a little bit of uh, spring onions or bunging onions for garnish. So that's all the ingredients we need. Simple, isn't it? Okay, so what you want to do is you want to take off the, the heads of the brinjal. and you want to keep the skin on so it holds the brain jaw intact so what, you, what what I want to do is to slice it up into halves first okay like so and then we have to slice it up into slightly thick pieces like these so I say about three 3 mm, one, 2 to 3 mm. So, like so. so. Okay, we're gonna have to sprinkle it with salt to get all the water out. So, this is not all gonna fit, but we'll try anyways. So we have some salt, so we'll just rub it over the brinch off. This is to ensure that all the water will be expelled. Once you're done, transfer the brinjal to a piece of paper towel. Can you see all the water is coming out already? So you want to leave this alone for about 15 minutes. Uh, to make sure that all the water is out. So now we're going to lay a, la a layer of uh, paper towel over these and uh, and then we'll come back to it. Okay, so while we're waiting for the brin jaw to get ready, uh, we're going to ground up our ginger. So I have with me a little grounder. I don't know what you call this, but we're just going to rub this over and uh, we'll just mash up the ginger like this and there you have it we only need about uh, one tablespoon of grounded ginger together with the juice okay now back to the brain jaw so it's been about 15 minutes right now so as you can tell a lot of water has been expelled from the brain jaw itself so we're just gonna lift off this wet piece of towel and then we'll put a new one just to make sure that all of the water has been expelled. So we just press it like this. 
still see some water in it, but not as much anymore. Okay, so then we'll lift it up. And the brinjal is ready. For the next step, uh, we're gonna take the uh, corn flour and we're just gonna sprinkle some at the bottom of a plate or a pan. Okay, just uh, spread it around a little bit. Okay, then we'll take the green jaw and we'll put it on. Okay, we'll give it a little bit of a coat. More if we need to. Okay, so let's get to cooking. We have some oil in a pan, right? So we're gonna set it to medium heat. Um, let the oil warm up to it. Okay, we're gonna put in a piece at a time. Okay, so this batch is about done too, so we introduce back the previous ones. Like so. And then what we're gonna do is we're gonna mix the mirin and the soy sauce together. Okay, and then we're just gonna rinse, pour it over the green dog. Give it a good shake. Lower the heat. And then we'll add the ginger. Give it a little bit stir. That's it.
Okay, everyone, time for a taste test. This looks gorgeous, doesn't it? Let's dip right into it. Definitely a whole bowl of rice. Definitely. I'm going in for the extra large piece now. Okay guys, I think that's all the time we have today. So uh, I, I really do hope you enjoyed the video and uh, you like the recipe and and do make it together with your family uh, and try it out. Uh, if you like the recipe, remember to like and subscribe and share my video. So okay, I'll see you guys on the next one. Bye bye.